But fuck Clayface. Yeah, well, Clayface is just... Okay, I'm glad you agree with me on that. Why does Clayface exist? Do you know the story of Clayface? I don't know, like, the history of Clayface. I know, like, the it's just origin. I just don't know the history. Like, where the, where the fuck did the character come from? Did they Clayface watch Spider-Man? Supposed, like, you know. where, <laughs> where did that come from? I think Clayface is just supposed to be one of the supervillains where it's just... You have to feel empathy to the supervillain because he's really sad. But, but he's, he's not. He's just an asshole. Yeah. But he's an asshole because of sad thing. No, he's not. He's just an asshole. Does What's his real name? Caesar? Something, no. Something ha- messed up that happened to his, someone he loved, though, didn't it, or something? He was an actor, and he lost the career, and then somehow turned into Clay. Yeah. And that's why he always... He has a family of Clay family members. I'm not kidding. It's the stupidest. They expand... Like, he has an extended Clay person family. He has a dumb name, too, that I can't remember. I just, you know... I just it sometimes blows me away how how well Batman is written and how well some of the super how how well some of the villains are and then they just sometimes they just shit the bed. You know what? You know it's who like it's you, a can't, total, you can't be perfect. You know all who the time. I like? Calendar Man. I like Calendar Man. He's dumb on paper, but like every time he says one of those rhymes, yeah. I get a little creeped out. Yeah. And he's really good for like, that. The fact that you in that game, it was in. Was it in two? It's in all three. Calendar Man makes yeah. an appearance in all three. But where you could, where you had to, you could go to the uh, prison and visit him, and if you visited him on certain dates, he'd save certain voice lines. Yeah, so I wanted to do that. It was in two. Oh, well, yeah. I did. I did it because I had it on PC, so I could just change the date time on my computer. You can change it on the 360 and PS3 too. Okay. But when? So it doesn't explain why he didn't do it. Does he say? Oh, he just has different voice lines for each of them. Okay. And it wasn't. Are they worth it? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. They're just a YouTube video wall. Yeah. yeah. But they're quite enjoyable. The, uh, the thing that I really loved, too, was that uh, his memoir of his parents that was in the second one, too. Like, talk out loud down the street. That was good. I liked that. I, yeah. I, went, and, I went and paid my respects. Is yeah. that what they call it? when yeah. you? Yeah, they call it pay your respects, and then you kneel down and touch it. That was yeah, good. I like that. Like, yeah. That's a really great thing. Yeah. I still love that... Uh, that comic that it happens when uh, when the whole thing goes down in the streets, Batman, Bruce dies, and then his mom snaps and becomes the Joker because she loses her mind, and then his dad becomes Batman. And they're I've never seen this. this oh, really? Like that's really yeah. That's oh, an that's alternate pretty universe good. thing where Bruce. I I think I read it a long time ago, but it's it's really widely respected. It's really awesome. I know it's it was wasn't a comic. It was a it's... it was a. Sh- Oh, what is what is his dad's name? name. Thomas. Not Walt. Thomas yeah. and Martha. Tom. No. Thomas I don't know. and. I don't know. I can't remember. Might be Martha. So during this entire conversation about Batman, Raiden is now having guilt trouble. about yeah, killing, this killing yeah. all these people yeah, because he didn't guy. realize that they were all just put in a really bad situation and had no choice but to fight for this PMC. So now he feels like a horrible dickhead. Yeah, I can see the guilt. <laughs> I can see the guilt. Yeah, just bleeding, bleeding heart. Look at all oh my guilt. Look at it. It's in nine parts, all <laughs> over the floor. <laughs> uh, that entire twenty-minute, half-an-hour conversation. Nothing at all, but it's good. Yeah. Well, this game wanted to be like Arkham, so a there's a bit. tie. A little bit. At least listen to the last of us is somewhat reasonable Yeah. Like, no, because no one listens like that. No one goes yeah, still. <laughs> and then uh, listens. Excuse me. No, no. Native Americans listening to the horses coming? Like Oh remember? my god, Native Vision. Remember <laughs> <laughs> there's this fucking game called <laughs> Damnation. And there's this move where the characters put their fingers to their temples, focus. And listen, and they get it from this native person who dies immediately after granting them the power, so we don't. No, he doesn't die, vision. no, he's there by the end of the story. Oh, okay. He just, like, is so a weird We dubbed it character. Native Vision. It's totally Native Vision. It's fucking. Yep, that game it's, is dumb. It's you totally know what? Who is that guy vision. from the Mortal Kombat game that's the native? Uh, Nightwolf. Is that not the most, like, stereotypical. Native Along with T Hawk? Yes. Yeah. And, um. Thunder. What? Chief Thunder. From. AI? Yeah. Chief Thunder's pretty Chief native. Chief Thunder, T-Hawk, Nightwolf. He comes into the battle with two tomahawks. They're pretty much all the same character. <laughs> yep. 
Native American stereotype. Except for the fact that I Chief have Thunder... I to say, like, really, if you want to talk about it, Native Americans are some of the worst stereotypes over, like, they've any gotten, stereotype that they've we got. There's some of them are... Some of them are really bad. Yeah. Yep. Like, there's just tons, and there's lots of them. Whereas with, like, when you talk about other races or nationalities, you'd have, like, one or two things that are the big stereotypes. Oh, my God. You can just you make a list of the things that we say about Native Americans. Yeah. Do you remember Lakota? The back medicine? Lakota. Oh, no. yeah, the commercials for the back yes. medicine. Oh, my God, those, those were, were so racist. Yeah. Those were they nuts. They had this all Indian guy, and, he's like and he was in back full in ceremonial back. dress, and he had back medicine <laughs> called yeah, and Lakota. And he's like, the in my, my tribe, people. this is what we would use made out of natural herbs. and like. Oh, my God, it's racist. Oh, it's the worst. Fuck. Made out of our 11 herbs and spices. Yeah, Help like, fix your back. viewers, if you ever want to see one of the most racist television ads for Native, Ever. Well, it's not for natives, but it uses. It was for white people. So, if you want to hear racism about Native Americans, go over to northern Canada, where half my family lives, and the second everybody gets more than one drink from them, the native jokes start coming out, and it gets pretty brutal pretty quickly. And western. Yeah. Midwestern Canada as well. How, like, how do you start an Indian? Put his paycheck under his work boots. Mm. Wow. <laughs> that is. I still oh. find it. I, it still seems fucked up that some people still call the natives Indians. Yeah. There's worse things because many you know natives what the call most they, they, they self-identify as Indians. You know what the Indian, most awkward so fine, thing to say is now? Uh, African Canadians. That one's weird. Yeah. That's, yeah. The tech, that's the term, though. It's the, te- it's the technically correct term. It's weird how often I used to encounter black people who would call themselves black and someone would say African American and they would go, I'm. Don't call me that. Yeah. <laughs> and it was I like, feel like that's oh, okay, way that's more fine, like dude. a ruder thing to call them than black. Well, like you can call them you. Like yeah, I. Well, it's because I don't it's know. because like you remember Fletch. Fletch never identified as an African Canadian or African American because he wasn't from Africa. So he's yeah. like, I'm I'm not from there. <laughs> don't call me that. So he always called himself black. That's fair. I like Fletch. I miss him. He's a good teacher. I should go to East Sweden anyway. Or like in the beginning. Of I thought the last time you went to our I almost former high school, you attack. almost had an anxiety attack. Yeah. Why? Because I because hate, you hated uh, that it's, school. It's why? Because I had a horrible time there. Oh really? Yeah. What? Horrible teachers and just a bad time, and I had very bad sense of self when I was there. Yeah. Because it's high school. Yeah. Right. So I attached the place to all those memories and ideas. So I just oh, had yeah. a shit time high going back there. The worst time yeah. Well, I was living with my mother for the first two years while I was in high school. I was hated it. Yeah, so the high school just, it's not a good place for me and most people, so like, I just I'll never don't want to go back to school. Hopefully. Not that I didn't have a good time and I saw quite a bit of a good group of my friends. But yeah, I yeah, totally. It's school. just the place. It's just the place. It's just, you know, uh, muscle memory in the hallways yeah. and stuff. I can start doing more. Well, yeah, like you remember walking to each of the classrooms and you knew how to get there every day. And you walk those paths again and you remember all the stuff that you raped in the locker room. No. I was never raped in a locker room. I was going to start saying lyrics from one of the songs in this game. Not so black now, are you, Ryden? What? The line is not so black and white now. Okay. (laughs) Not so black now, Ryden. Good talk about Batman, though. Yeah. Here's okay. We talk about it for the rest of our life. This, I love talking this about character love design. Ta- is I love uh, talking about Batman. I don't like a lot of DC stuff because it's it's some of them are so overpowered. Do you not find that? Oh yeah, the only big one for me is Superman. Superman's such a chode. Other than that, the other ones are all pretty cool. I'm really interested in okay. Batman. I love him. Okay, is he the green guy? Yes. Yeah. Okay, I've always wondered who he is. He calls himself Marshall Manhunter? Martian. Martin. Said Marshall meant Martian. Okay. Yep. Yeah, and he's just... Does he go by that name all the time, or does he ever say... I, I think am. he has a, a he name. Ha- he has a name, John. John Jones. Does he ever not but green? Does he have a Martian name? Does he ever green? Or is his name always? When he was named or? on Mars. Whatever. Well, I forget what it is now. I can't think of it now. But no, I, he has some Martian name, but nobody can say because it's Martian. Yeah, right. just like Kyle. So they call him John. John Johns or something like that. I forget his last name. Is one of the names is Jaws. 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 Jaws.
What's that? Hi, I can't name fucking even remember any of it now. <laughs> For being somebody that was just talking so big about DC, I can't well, remember. Well, you were talking big about Batman. No, but I am really into DC. I just haven't read it in a while, though. But anyways... There was that one awesome time where Deathstroke shot the kid Flash in the knee with his shotgun, and they couldn't fix his knee because he was healing so fast. That was pretty cool. That was pretty high stress right there. I have that comic. It's called Child's Play. Have you read Child's Play? I probably have. It's really good, actually. For as little as I like the Teen Titans, I really enjoyed it. Yeah. It's Teen Titans. Yeah. Kind of rough. Meh. Sometimes. Yeah. yeah. Unless you're talking about, like... Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. What? He was okay, shaking his knee up yep. and down, which was shaking the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> I really hope that's not my bad. Did you know that memes are the DNA of our soul? <laughs> that's what Monsoon just said. Drugs, lol. 